What's up, what's up, what's up, John? Your boy Black Nate DB Asim. You know, I'm unstoppable. But let's talk about money. You know, some people have it, some don't. Um, it ain't really money's the root of all evil. It's pretty much like what you do with the money. Um, you got people that's broke, you got people that got money, you got people that's wealthy, and you got people that's rich. And you got people that's piss poor. Um, it's all up to you. Sometimes it's like how you was brought up. Um, it can be like you, you don't know about money or, or a lot of minorities wasn't taught how to you know flip money and how to uh, make money turn for them. So they blow it. Buy a lot of material stuff, cars, jewelry, uh, females. They blow it all the time. You do is wake up and blow it. You really ain't got nothing coming in. So when you got a lot going out and you ain't got nothing coming in, that's pretty much um, a big problem. I mean, because you're not going to be able to sustain that lifestyle if you don't invest it. Um, a lot of people think that they got a good car, a nice car, or whatever, and they think they're living a life, and they really ain't. Um, it's depending on what they, your level. You know, if you think that you got a nice car and you made it, then so be it. But you have no investments, and those that don't know what to do with money, they blow it. Casinos, you know, females, cars. Every day they look for ways to blow it. Now, people with money make that money invest. They're more so looking for investments instead of buying like expensive cars and three hundred thousand dollar cars and stuff you don't need. That's the difference with the two. Poor people, man, their mentality is poor, so they always be poor. They feel like, oh, I can't do this, man. And you try to show them something, man, they don't believe in it. That's because they're so mentally beat down. They don't know how to feel that something else is happening for them. Or they've been down so long, they don't know how to get up. Or they don't believe that it's going to be a blessing. You know? Um. It's what you do with money and how you make money work for you. Uh, money just magnifies who you are. It pretty much like brings out an asshole, it brings out a kind person, it brings out a good person, it brings out a bad person. You know, you can be one of those four. Um, I might have skipped some other ones, but those are the main ones. Uh, what would you do if you get some money? You know, you're going to help some people, you're going to stun out, you're going to be worried about yourself, you're going to be selfish. Uh, how you work with money. Money is a tool to buy what you want, pretty much. It's good for a trade. You anything that you want to get with the money. Uh, money damn near buy anything nowadays, but it won't buy no true love. Now, if you got a female next to you because you got money and, and you didn't have nothing, um, she wasn't that fine or what, no, no dime until you start getting money, and that's what she around you for. Uh, dudes change up, too. You know, if you got money, money brings out who it is. It brings out your best friend, brings out your husband, your wife. Your girlfriend, your cousin, your sister, your mother, your brother. Uh, the preacher want to get some of your money too if you're religious or if you go to church and pay your tithes. That money, man, so money brings a lot of different situations around you. So with that being said, your boy Black Nate DiBiase, 523. Like and share my videos, y'all. All right, peace.